I know you're a liar, but thank you. So what do you think? That's great, doesn't it? Yep. And we finished, what do you think? Hey, brilliant. You know, you'd think you were an art teacher. Listen, you'll be fine. This is just what you need. Good way to make amends, eh? Look, lady, you have got nothing to feel guilty about. Hey, just gonna move on and all that. Yeah. Um, why don't you finish up here? I'll be back in a sec. Oh, right, just leave me with all the hard graph. Where are you going? Um, I've just got a few things to sort out in the office, Salam. Catch up with you later. Investigation hanging over her head. I don't think he was too bothered about that. She's just lost Grace, remember? Exactly. It's too soon for her. No, no, no. Today is going to help her come to terms with a lot of stuff. I think it's really important that she's here. Oh. Here he is, the prodigal son, Andrew Trenerman. This is Rachel Mason and Eddie Lawson. Good to meet you, Andrew. Very nice to meet you. Really good that you could come today. Fantastic response from the kids and the parents. Do you want to see what we've all done? Any excuse to clear out the old junk? It's amazing. <laughs> Yes, um, I've arranged an early lunch so we can devote the whole afternoon to fundraising. <laughs> and Andrew has kindly offered to open up proceedings at lunchtime and uh, get things rolling with the cashometer. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, we've set a target of £1,000, so hopefully by the end of the day we'll have a nice cheque for you. Thank you. But we better get on. Yes, um, we'll catch up with you later. See you. Steph, what do you want me to do with this? Um, Andrew, what do you think? Hello. Hi. Why? What? What are you doing here? I was asked. Well, I thought that you would need some help here, and uh, who better than? Doesn't he look great, eh, Mr. Trendyman? The hall looks good. Oh yeah. Well, um, you know, kids did most of it. Looks like they've really put their hearts into it. Right, well, um, you two must have a lot of organising and catching up to do. If I could set up my presentation somewhere. Yeah, yeah, well, Kim will help. Oh, and by the way, I've organised some publicity for the day. There's a guy called Cameron Jessup is going to come down from the Gazette, if you don't mind. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Right, see you later. So, uh, what exactly did Steph say to get you in there? Uh, she just said that you needed me. Things have been hard. She told you about Grace? She didn't have to. Grace is back with her family. Hi. This is young Cameron from the Gazette. This is Andrew Trenerman. Hi. Kim Campbell. It's good to be here. Hey, nice to meet you. He's seen the hall and he's very impressed, aren't you? Oh, yes. We've also arranged that every lesson will have a Rwandan theme. So how are you going to do maths on Rwanda? <laughs> good question. Andrew. Uh, looking at the country statistics, graphs, area of land, people to land ratio, percentages. Andrew will be here all day if you want to ask him any other questions, and of course, I'll be around. Hey, <laughs> <coughs> thanks. Is she okay? Yeah. yeah, she's doing really well. But, but how, how is she? Has she seemed to have settled yeah, down? She's perfectly all right. Look, uh, Kim. We need to talk about what happened. I know. I know you deserve that, but it's just... <sighs> Right now isn't the best time for me. The last couple of weeks have yeah, been... One more reason that we should talk things through. I owe you a massive apology. I know that. Right, things didn't work out my fault. It's just right now I, I, I can't pick over the bones of our relationship. Uh, no, Ken, no. That's, that's not what I meant. Oh, my God, Mr. Shredder, what are you doing here? Janice. <laughs> You're not seeing it for ages. Why have I been away? I was Rwanda. Ah, uh, really, really interesting. Are you back as the deputy again? No, no, no. 